Hey, I'm Derek Johnson. I work with 3D Systems. I am a product manager for the MultiJet Printing product line. We have three main printers within that product line, and I manage from conceptualization, uh, the design work with engineering, and finally commercialization. Coming to shows like this, I'm the product expert, but I also work really closely with our sales guys and our channel managers to help them close sales. We are really excited to talk about our newest technology, our newest printer within MJP, which is the ProJet MJP 2500. So the ProJet 2500 uh, really addresses first entry level, high quality productivity and prototyping capability. And it's extremely competitive in its market for its price point, as well as what it can offer in terms of the quality of parts, as well as the range of uh, materials to address a lot of different applications. So the ProJet MJP 2500 offers five different materials. We have three rigid materials, one black, white, and clear, and then two elastomerics, one black and one natural. So the great thing about the 2500 is that it addresses a lot of different applications in a number of industries. So any company that's doing prototyping right now that's looking to develop uh, concept models, functional test models, that can range from aerospace, um, automotive, um, consumer electronics, healthcare, medical device manufacturing, a number of different industries and segments would find usefulness with this uh, particular new printer. I think the industry is still relatively young. I mean, 30 years seems like a long time, but it's still really young, and I think right now we're starting to see a real ramp up, and it's around material capabilities. I think we have some amazing printers out there, but people are really looking for really functional prototyping materials, as well as production uh, materials. So we see a lot of opportunity, not only with the ProJet MJP 2500, but with all of our technologies that we offer with 3D Systems to really move into functional in-use parts. So this machine fit, fits into the overall ecosystem at the entry level. Entry level, most people who are either new to 3D printing or who have budget constraints are looking for a low cost but a very capable 3D printer. And the ProJet MJP 2500 meets that need extremely well. It's got a very affordable price point, but it also doesn't compromise on part quality, ease of use, which I think is really, really important, as well as uh, addressable applications. So I talked a little bit about the ProJet 2500, but let me tell you about a, few more, a couple of more products that we have. We have the ProJet MJP 3600, which is our workhorse. It's our flagship printer. Um, it's been, been around for about eight, eight years. Wonderful set of material properties, great uh, resolution part production. Uh, the ProJet MJP 5500X is really exciting. It's our first multi-material printer. It allows us to blend two unique materials and create composite materials. So we can create a range of very specific application uh, addressable materials based on blending two base materials. So that's very exciting because we just recently launched two new elastomeric materials. Those elastomeric materials have a great deal of flexibility, uh, elongation, and they open the door for a, a number of functional prototyping applications.